And speaking of the pandemic, remember all the empty shelves? There was no canned food, toilet paper, couldn't get paper towels. That was happening back in the spring. Well, fortunately, stores have bounced back for the most part, but now they're preparing to deal with demand if a second wave of shortages happens. Based on the surge in COVID cases across the country, it could happen sooner than expected. Team Trials' Vicki Wynn shows us what to stock up on right now before it's too late. Who can forget these images from March? Bare shelves at stores coast to coast, toilet paper, disinfectant, and hand sanitizer? Scarce. Now, with election uncertainty and new COVID surges, 57% of consumers surveyed say they are stocking up. I'm obviously concerned about the food shortages. But retail experts say don't panic. Stores and food manufacturers are much better equipped to deal with demand. What do you say to consumers then to tell them not to hoard? Uh, there is plenty of food to go around. You may not have the exact uh, products that you're looking for, but there will be options. Grocer Albertson says it's seeing shoppers making fewer trips to the store, but buying more with each visit or online order, saying we are incredibly well prepared, but it's still difficult to get items like cleaning sprays, wipes and flour. General Mills CEO Jeff Harmoning says the company has spent the past seven months preparing for the COVID holiday crush. We ramped up production on all the things that have sold out and we're highly confident that there will be product on the shelf available for consumers. The most in-demand items are shifting too. Baking goods up 3,400% this October compared to this time last year. And now shoppers want to buy more frozen dinners, pasta, snacks, and cleaning products. Tupperware, another surprise winner, stock up 35%, with more of us cooking and storing leftovers at home. For tech-savvy shoppers, many websites alert you when hard-to-find products are restocked. And experts say that the key to getting what you need is to make a list now and plan ahead and resist the urge to hoard and buy what you need early. Demand for holiday groceries is expected to peak in the two weeks before Thanksgiving.